Hey everybody, how you doing? This is about to be a really fun video. Quick video today, guys, showing you this chisel plow attachment. i give you a little bit closer look here. This is the Black Boar chisel plow. I've got it attached to my motorized implement lift. I'll show you that here in a second, but this is my first time using this chisel plow. I'm gonna show you the use of it, some before and after, but since I got the motor on here, it makes it super, super easy and simple to adjust the height. Let me show you here. I'm gonna start off with a pretty non-aggressive cut with this plow. Let me go ahead and lower it down in there. I've got the switch wired up over here. There we go. And like I said, I'm gonna start off with a pretty non-aggressive cut and if I need to dig a little bit deeper I will but let me kind of show you the dirt that I'm plowing up here so I can show you a good before and after I've got this baby hooked up to this Kawasaki Mule Pro FXT 1000 since it's got the camo this is the LE camo model it's got that true timber strata pattern pretty sweet and just to show you how I did it for this, I attached my switch right here on the grab bar. Worked out pretty good, but this is the ground that I'm turning up. We're gonna do some food plots. You can see it's got some rocks and doodads and weeds and I didn't spray it. I probably could have, should have, but I did keep it mowed close. But here's the before guys. Now I'm gonna make some passes with this chisel plow and we're gonna see how she runs for us I'm gonna put her in four-wheel drive and low and we're just gonna cruise real easy like to start off far so good working good just to show you the first cut here like I said I didn't get too aggressive but it definitely pulled up some of the rocks and some of the roots and started to tear up the top now I'm gonna lower it a little bit more and uh, get to doing some serious dirt moving you can see where I pulled up a couple rocks and stuff I'm gonna Pull these up before I do some more. Shoo, doggy, it has warmed up out here today. But I told you guys I was gonna show you before and after. You saw the before, now check out the after. So, right about here is where I started. And I should have counted, but this is six or seven passes. And you can see all this is broken up. That whole top layer of dirt's been turned over it actually helped me pull through a bunch of the thatch so you can see little strays of the grass that was there but that plow ripped up all that thatch you can see off to the sides where i didn't do kind of what it looked like before but six or seven passes yeah buddy did exactly what i needed it to do that chisel plow ended up working awesome pretty pretty sweet thanks for watching this quick video guys that is the black boar I'm looking over here, but you guys are over here. That's the black bore chisel plow attachment. And again, you got to have that uh, implement lift that we attached it to, but super easy to use, super easy to put on. You can see here in a video that did a great job. If I did have to give you one bit of advice using this thing, don't try to do it all in one pass. Just lower that baby a little bit at a time. First go, just barely scratch the surface, especially on a piece of dirt like this that hadn't been turned in who knows how many years. You never know what rocks or tree branches and all that's barely under the dirt. Just take your time like I did, six or seven passes, got me done just exactly what I wanted it to do. But hey, go check out Black Boar and all their implements. After this, I'm actually about to attach the disc harrow smooth some of this out for our food plots but 
down below there'll be a 10 percent off discount code for black boar y'all go check them out check out their site if you need to turn up some dirt for some food plots or garden or what have you and you got an atv or side by side like we use today check them out black boar appreciate y'all watching we'll see you on the next one Hoo -hoo.